Can you tell us your name and where you're from? My name is Bogdan and I'm from the Tri-Cities. And so Bogdan, can you tell us the problem that you were having and the testimony you have to share with us today? So the problem I was having is I had an intense amount of pain in my left ear and I couldn't hear whatsoever. And how did, you, how did this happen to your ear? You say you had intense pain, but what happened to you to cause that pain? Uh, I was working on, a, I was looking under my car and it was parked on a sidewalk. And as I was looking under, the car fell on my left side of my head. And that's how it happened. And how long ago did this happen to you? It actually happened last Sunday. And for how long were you having that pain? And you said you couldn't hear out of your ear. When, um, how long were you having that pain? Uh, just for the day. And so, Bogdan, how did you receive your healing? Well, it was the day that there was home group, so I went to home group. We prayed for my ear. I didn't receive it immediately, but the next day I woke up and I heard clearly. Wow, let's put our hands together for Jesus. So you mean to say that the car actually fell on your head, on the left side of your head? Yes. <laughs> and you couldn't hear whatsoever? Not one thing. So if you were to put your hand on your right ear and someone were to talk to you, you wouldn't be able to hear anything? I can hear. No, of course. Oh, yeah. Of course. I couldn't hear. Like, I couldn't even concentrate during home group because of the pain, and I couldn't really hear through that left ear at all. Like, I turn like this sideways to hear. And Bogdan, can you demonstrate for us right now? Put your hand, your right hand on your right ear, and I want you, uh, can you hear what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah perfectly clear. Yep, perfectly clear. Praise the Lord. Let's give Jesus Christ another round of applause. So, Bogdan, what advice can you give for people here today who uh, have pain or anything like that, similar to like what Angela had, but for you, you know, you received your healing in the home group. What advice do you have for these people? 